What's up guys, welcome back to EMC. We are taking the car to Diamant Diamo because this car needs to be protected to the max before I can take the car out and actually go for a proper drive because that's what you guys all want to see, right? And to be honest with you, I'm itching to have a proper drive. I need to go to the Canyon Roads. I need to just blast the shit out of the mountain roads, but I'm not gonna do that because this paint is too expensive and it's too precious and way too dope. So we're gonna go get protected with a 3M PPF wrap and I'm gonna get Greenway window tints. I don't think I'm gonna go full black because I kind of like the fact that it's transparent right now. I might just choose something that's a little bit tinted. You can still kind of see the inside. You can see the roll cage, the club sport, bucket seats. You know, you gotta show off in this car. So let's get going. I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace. So I just got the Diamond Diamo, and you know what? I see a GT3 RS here, a GTS. Seems like everyone's getting into Porsches again, and it seems like they're doing a lot of Porsche work right now. So we're gonna get the Scotchgard 3M Paint Protection Film Pro Series, and I can't wait till that is done. We're gonna do some follow-up, so I'll catch you guys later. Peace. The 902 GT3 just finished the Scotchgard 3M PPF Pro Series film wrap. The Scotchgard has the thickest film protection, but it's also the most clear. It's nighttime outside and we are under pretty decent lighting. Not the best, but you know what? It looks really, really nice. Another reason I went with the Scotchgard 3M PPF Pro Series, it doesn't have that yellow effect after time. Their glue is still top of the line. Supposedly it does have this type of self-healing adhesive function on it. You know, you have bracelets or whatever and you're walking by and you do scratch your car. And sometimes when you go to a detailing shop or you get your car washed and they're not very gentle or they create a lot of swirls, this is where this 3M PPF shines. It kind of just erases and self heals all those swirls. That's pretty amazing already. I, I do want to see if that really works. But enough about that. I just want to give a proper and a big shout out to Diamond. Their skills and craftsmanship is honestly top of the line. If you guys are looking for a PPF wrap or a color wrap, you guys should come to Diamond. Their link is down below. The last shout out goes to Greenway Films because I actually needed tints on this, but I did not want to get dark tints, okay? Now, a lot of people with the GT3, they choose an option for the rear windows to be black. Actually, this rear and the rear side windows. Both could be black, but I didn't get that. I got all clear. Now, I went with the GS70 Plus to match all of the surrounding windows and windshield, so it's all the same color, so it's cohesive. But thank you, Greenway. You guys are awesome. I heard that the Scotchgard 3 MPPF wrap is coming out with a new version, an updated film wrap. I'm very excited for that. And I'm actually gonna take the Cayenne here very soon. I drive that car literally every day and I actually wanna protect it. So, the vlog continues. The last couple of days, as you can tell from the montage, the Cayenne has been here uh, getting some work done with the new Scotchgard 3M PPF. The good news is that the new Pro Series 200 gloss 
got here just in time for us to install on the Cayenne Turbo. And I'm actually pretty excited to show you guys because you know what? It, it looks really, really glossy. Under normal lighting conditions, it looks even glossier as if it just got a brand new detailing or wax job. I'm actually very, very satisfied. And the cool thing that I heard is that it's got a special texture. Okay, so when, when I touch this, you guys are gonna have to trust me when I say it. Um, it's, it's got a very soft, smooth texture as if there was a coating on it. And I think that's what's really, really cool. And it's supposed to, you know, be kind of like dust deterrent. You see some dust, you just kind of blow on it and it flies off, it's not sticky. And I guess you might even save a bunch of money on car detailing. I'm very impressed with it. Um, we got the whole car wrapped. We even got the carbon fiber wrapped under here. So that is really, really good work. I'm examining all of the work that they're doing. They really did an amazing job. They wrapped everything on the inside as well. So, you know, it would protect the paint if I'm doing any hardcore driving in an SUV, which I might. And, you know, it would protect it against all the rock chips. Uh, even on the bottom diffuser here. Wow, they wrapped it really good. Yeah, protecting my headlights. That is very, very important because rock chips on headlights and if there's a crack in your headlight, it's gone. So that'll probably save me money too. And we have protection on the front windshield. As always, that's a must. And oh, nice, the mirrors are wrapped as well. You know what? You can't overlook the details. Some guys, you know, they just want to wrap the front and maybe this and maybe the windshield, but you know what? Like, you should consider wrapping the whole car. At least I do. The top is very important. Even the pillars and, you know, the doors, the handles, like everything for me has to be wrapped. So there's one thing that I kind of regret is that I didn't get the new Scotchgard paint protection film Pro Series 200 gloss on the GT3. I mean, it literally just got to Taiwan and my Cayenne Turbo is the first to have this new PPF on. So I guess I can kind of say I am the only one right now, which makes it pretty special. I just want to say thank you 3M for making me the only guy in Taiwan right now with the 3M paint protection film, the newest, the Pro Series 200 gloss. Also I wanna say thank you to Frank and Gustavo. You guys are awesome. And now I am finally ready to take the GT3 for a drive and tell you guys all the feedback and give you guys a thorough review. And I get to finally drive the shit out of the Cayenne Turbo. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Keep watching EMC, peace.